the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. In the Ascension, I wanted to tell you three things. Number one, number one, the Lord gathered the disciples and they looked at him when they were at the mountain and he started to go up, 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 till he disappeared from their sights. Here, the Lord, the Word of God, is God. Does he need to ascend? Does he? He doesn't. Because he is always in the bosom of the Father. He said, my Father is in me, and I am in the Father. So what is different? Why the ascension? The ascension is to take us in him, is to take us to be in the bosom of the Father, on the right hand of the Father, to reconcile us with the Father. So the question here is, where are you? Are you still there? Or have you come down to live on earth as everyone else? No. We all Christians in Jesus Christ, we've been ascended with him. And we are in heaven. We are in the bosom of the Father. So the whole point here now is what, is what, where are you? Where are you? you. Number two, when he was ascending, they kept looking up to heaven. Even when he disappeared, they still looking up. And this is the second point. If you are in heaven, fix your eyes upon heaven. It has been said that the Lord fixed his eyes on Jerusalem. He went into Jerusalem and didn't come back. That was the end. <coughs> if you fix your eyes upon heaven, you will go to heaven and you will be in heaven. Think differently. <coughs> See things differently. And feel things differently. You are in heaven, fixing your eyes, your heart, your aims, your hopes upon heaven. The third thing, the, the angel came and told them what? Why are you looking up like that? He will come back. He will come back. So you are not living only in heaven. And fixing your eyes, hopes, intentions, and love to heaven, but as well you are waiting for his second coming. Waiting for his second coming. And that makes us be ready anytime, anytime. May our Lord Jesus Christ makes us feel and live in heaven. Keep looking up and wait for his second coming glory. Thank you.